If you're a technician, a hobbyist, or just someone curious about how TVs work. Knowing what each memory IC does inside the main board can help a lot, especially when you're diagnosing issues. Welcome back to the channel. Today we're diving into something important, but often overlooked. The different types of memory ICs used inside TV mainboards, from old LCD models to the latest smart LED TVs, each one has a unique memory setup. These memory chips store important data that keeps your TV working properly. Let's break it all down in simple terms. Inside every TV mainboard, you'll find several types of memory ICs. These small chips handle different jobs. They store user settings, um, firmware, panel configurations, um, and much more. And depending on the type of TV, whether it's a non-smart TV or a smart TV, the memory configuration is different. Let's begin with non-smart TVs. These usually use two types of memory ICs. Number one, EEPROM, and number two, NOR flash memory. This could be either SPI NOR or parallel NOR. Let's start with the EEPROM. This chip stores your personal settings like volume level, channel info, brightness, like, and contrast. It also keeps factory settings. For example, the color calibration used during quality control. Another important job, EEPROM remembers the last power state. If your TV was on before a power cut, it will turn back on when electricity returns. And lastly, if the EEPROM chip is faulty, you won't be able to access service mode or factory mode. That makes repairs and diagnostics much harder. Now let's look at the NOR flash memory. This is where the main firmware is stored. It also contains panel settings and data for the TV's microcontroller unit, or MCU. Some common examples of NOR flash ICs are the 25XXX series, a M29LV800D, and SST39VF1601. If you ever need to update the firmware, this is the chip that gets flashed. Now let's talk about smart TVs. They have more complex systems and need more advanced memory. Early smart TVs use different combinations like NOR flash plus NAND flash, NOR flash plus EMMC, or sometimes a single NAND flash that stored everything, the bootloader, the operating system, uh, and the main firmware. But here's the problem. NAND flash isn't always reliable, especially inside a TV, where the heat can damage the chip over time. It tends to fail more frequently, so what's the solution? Most modern smart TVs now use a single EMMC flash memory chip. Why EMMC? Because it's faster, more stable, and more reliable. It's like the internal storage you find in smartphones, it can handle both read and write operations smoothly, and it stores everything the TV needs to boot and run. Let's sum it all up. Non-smart TVs use EEPROM plus NOR flash memory. Smart TVs used to use NOR plus NAND, but now they mostly use EMMC. Each memory chip has a specific job. Some store your settings, some load the firmware, Others help the system boot correctly. If this video helped you out, don't forget to like, subscribe, and share it with your fellow tech lovers. Have a question, or maybe your own repair story? Drop it in the comments. I'd love to hear from you. Thanks for watching Fix Netflix. I'll see you in the next video with more expert repair tips. Until then, happy fixing!